Hi there, welcome to the Cottage Community Idea House. This project is being built by Jerry Efren of Grey Rock Homes. Jerry built our Fairfield County farmhouse last year. And while that project was a single family home overlooking the Long Island Sound, this project is very different. And today, Jerry's gonna tell us about it. Hey Jerry. Hey Chris, how are you? Good, how good you doing? Good to see you again. Nice to see Welcome you too. Welcome back to Norwalk. Thank you, it's good to be here. It's great. So you and Sandy have built a lot of homes in your career and uh, this one's quite different. Yeah, a little bit. You know, the last uh, design home of course was a single family home on a large lot. Now we have a pocket neighborhood of 10 homes. Uh, we have five buildings with two units in each building. And uh, it's a little different concept than what's currently available in the, uh, in the area. We wanted to start the design process with basically all of your living amenities on the first floor. Then of course, once you build the footprint, you have some space up, you have some space below, and then you try to fill in and match the needs of your potential uh, residents. And this location in proximity to amenities, how does it fit in there? Well, you have everything. I mean, everything is literally within a half a mile. You have shopping and restaurants all along the main avenue. And we're just three miles from our farmhouse on the golf course and the Calf Pasture Beach and Sono. And right in our backyards, we have the Five Mile River, which is just a tremendous uh, resource. We know from the Fairfield County Farmhouse, you love building near the water. Don't we you? do. We do <laughs> love the. We love our views. So. Uh, You've got some of it started already. Yep. Can you uh, take us through and tell us what the, sure. what's going on? Well, this first building is uh, two units. They're attached here at the garage, and we have five buildings like this. The next building will be the same with a walkout basement because of the grade. A unique project, hardworking footprints, and you've got one well underway. Can you show us around? Sure. Today the first floor was finished and we're just working on the second floor and uh, they just bought concrete walls in the second building. Alright, so what's going on in here? Well Chris, we've got uh, the heart of the home here. So we have a little family room with some built-in desk potential. We have a dining area. We have a kitchen with a center island for cooking and eating. We have a mud room off the garage and a laundry room. Additionally, we have a beautiful screened in porch that we're gonna have out here overlooking the river. And of course, we have a primary suite, large uh, bedroom, closet, and bathroom area. So Jerry, you mentioned some living space downstairs. Can we take a look? Sure. Well, Chris, this has uh, multi potential functions. Uh, you know, it could be a home office, uh, but we've uh, set it up so that if someone needed it as a guest bedroom or live in help, uh, we wanted to make sure that it met all the safety requirements. And it looks like the window's a little bigger than normal. Well, this is an egress window, so it's a maximum distance off the floor, and it has these steps to get out uh, up to grade. So in the event of emergency, people can easily and properly get outside. It's also nice to have the natural light in here, irrespective of the use. And of course, when we're done planting it up and, and finishing it out, you'll see at the end, it's gonna be very attractive. It's great, planning ahead, I love it. Oh, look at this back here patio here? Yeah, Chris, we're going to have the screened in porch up above for the main level. We'll put a little patio underneath the screen porch, of course. We'll landscape here to give a little privacy to this uh, building. So, of course, this is going to be all maintenance-free uh, materials. And um, we'll have a little uh, fence here to separate. Between the two units. Yep, between these two units to separate the areas. And this will be very nicely uh, landscaped. We'll create a nice uh, 
buffer here to the natural habitat. So river right there, some opportunities for some recreation. Yeah, just bring your fishing pole and throw it right in. I'm sure you catch something. <laughs> Are you gonna put a path in here or? No, we're not gonna do a path. Uh, we're gonna leave it in its natural habitat, really protect the, the natural resource there. We don't wanna start encroaching into, you know, the, the habitat. I like it, that's great. Just leave it natural. All right, Jerry. What are some of the challenges you're facing here? It's gotta be some. Well, uh, right now our biggest hurdle is making sure that we get the materials we need on site when we need them. So it's a challenge. We have a lot going on. We have excavation. We have a lot of extra material and we're bringing in uh, certain products, a lot of lumber for buildings that we haven't started yet to uh, make sure we have what we need and you know prices are going up. So we're trying to we have very good relationships with our suppliers and they with their suppliers. So we're working together to get the material we need when we need it. That's really the biggest challenge right now. And what's happening next here? So we've got a lot going on in the next couple of weeks. We'll have our uh, fascia and uh, rakes up. Um, we'll get those primed. We'll put our uh, roof shingles and our skylights in. We'll have our windows and we'll start our siding. Meanwhile, inside, we're going to continue with our HVAC ducting and our piping, some of our valves, etc. And then uh, once we're tight, we'll get the electrician in here and uh, we're, we hope to be sheetrocking in a few weeks. That's great. It's a lot of movement. A lot of activity. It's looking great, Jerry. Thank it's you. coming along. It is. Looking forward to seeing more progress. Thank you for joining us. Please tune in next time. Until then, I'm Chris Ermides. And I'm Jerry Efren. For the Cottage Community Idea House, this old house. Next up on the Cottage Idea House, the roof goes on and the insulation goes in. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project, so be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button to make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.